Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So at this point we went through and showed you how to install JDK for Windows. We I have a video on how to install Android Studio on Windows as well. Apple, a lot easier. It's the same thing basically. But there's no JDK process with Apple because you you know it automatically has that information already in it. So it makes it a little bit easier. So the next thing is before we actually start setting up Android and start programming, it's very it's recommended that you have some Java background. So hopefully uh, you've taken CIT 111 or CIT 130. I know that some students may have not taken it and I gave them permission to take a course. But what I wanted to do is kind of go over some, just to give you some pinpoints if you don't have that. So let's do this, let's get off of me. So if you go over here to my YouTube channel, I definitely recommend to subscribe if you want to. You don't have to, but um, if you go out to my playlist, I still have to update this. There are some new things I haven't added, but for mo for the most part, if you go to playlist, uh, I try to break things down. But if you go into uh, Java development, I have a list of different slurs of different things here. It'll walk you through different things with um, just to kind of get familiar with. Java a little bit if, if that's going to be a problem just kind of getting started I would recommend that um, so like it'll help you with uh, Java programming from scratch so I'll show you how to compile Java I use Eclipse within my it'll show you introduction to variables they talk about integers they talk about different uh, variables such as floats charts doubles etc I go in a little bit of explanation on booleans We'll set up our first uh, environment using uh, a console application. We'll get a little bit more detail within, we'll talk about looping. We go through and how to install Eclipse. Uh, we talk about exception handling. We talk about interfaces, uh, override methods. What is a method and, and classes? Uh, we get a little bit even further into a deeper dive. Uh, we talk about swing components. We talk about Java FX and so forth. And I think there's actually I'll go back here. I believe there's a section just on Java FX itself, and yeah, so Java FX is um, another form of Java development as well. So we go through a lot of different things, or I go through a lot of different things on there. So use it as a resource. Um, obviously, you use the internet as well. So if there's some things that you don't understand, but for the most part, everything that we do in a class online will, will you know, will um, help within the dev development aspect of it. So we've interested. All right. So uh, the next video that we'll talk about is we'll go ahead and open up Android, and I'll go through and discuss a little bit about Android and go from there. So uh, thanks for listening, and uh, I'll see you into the next video. Thanks.